So here are the, the yurts. They actually have fire inside. And uh, these go for $185 a night. I just met a couple from New York and they said they did it for the experience. Let's see if I can see if anybody's in here. Hello? I can like take a little peek. Peek inside. It's like it's kind of cozy. Fire pit in the middle. Yep, there you go. 185 bucks. And then uh, we got some yurts here. I don't know how much they go for. Probably about the same. And then um, what they're really famous for are these uh, are these trailers, vintage vintage trailers. They're all very old. Uh, some of them from are from the 30s and 40s. And they go for um, like $200 a night. And I, I think they all have a toilet inside, but you have to use the um, outdoor outdoor showers. But they're um, they're kind of cute. I'm sure they're really cute inside. Uh, but some of them go for, you know, like $230 a night. And they are always booked. Uh, we came in at about 4 o'clock yesterday and, and they were all booked. It kind of reminds me a little bit of Mystic Hot Springs. But uh, Mystic Hot Springs wasn't nearly this expensive. So yeah, a little town of Marfa, and it's uh, known as an artist community. The Chinati Foundation is, uh, I think, I think they're the people that are kind of responsible for having this place grow up and become so famous. A lot of stars and celebrities and artists come here. There's a, apparently there's a really big, uh, very fancy resort just down the road and a lot of um, celebrities stay there and and then come into town and this is an outdoor kitchen so there you go El Cosmico in Marfa West Texas